The Ledbetter Fair Pay Act, however, shifted the focus from changes in pay to current compensation levels. This act requires the examination of not only compensation decisions made during the class period, but also compensation decisions and all other employment practices that affect compensation, regardless of when in the course of an individual's employment such practices began. So how exactly does one construct a model of compensation decisions? One approach is based on human capital theory. Using this approach, the econometrician models compensation as a function of the employee's human capital variables. Examples of human capital variables are education, prior experience, and seniority. The central assumption underlying this model is that, on average, employees should be compensated the same regardless of gender or race. Under this